Every Friday night is Bellator Fighting Championships live on MTV2, Epix, and Spike.com. Bellator 68 from Caesars in Atlantic City, New Jersey. We open with the Bellator fight at the catchweight of 172 pounds. Watch him Spirit Wolf versus Marius Jaromskis. You now Spirit Wolf kept to the game plan in the opening round, kept it close, tight, clinched up against the fence. Jaromskis got this takedown in the first round, and in the second round got his striking going, but Spirit Wolf turned it around with this series of punches, got Jaromskis rocked. You see here, he angles and literally runs away from Joaquin Spirit Wolf. Spirit Wolf stays on him, does not get the finish, but tragedy strikes at the end of the second round. You see here the blood above the eye. The doctor calls an end to the fight because of the cut in between rounds. Next up, lightweights. Marcin Held versus Derek Kennington. Marcin Held getting tagged on the feet by Kennington. He changes the script. You see here shooting for the double leg. And look, beautiful job rolling backward for the heel hook. He gets it and cranks it. Marcin Held known for his leg locks. You see here putting the torque on. Kennington, no choice but to tap. He wins via heel hook in the first round. On then to the bantamweight tournament in semifinal number one, Travis Marks versus Marcos Galvão. Marcos Galvão, a two-time world champion in jiu-jitsu. Maybe someday he'll use it in the Bellator cage, but this fight was just like the other, slinging bombs, putting pressure on with big strikes. Travis Marks kept it close in that second round, able to keep his clinch work going and went from the outside, but in the third round, Galvan turned it on once again, backing the wrestler up with big strikes. He wins the decision victory. With that victory, Marcos Galvo becomes the first finalist in the Bellator Season 6 Bantamweight Tournament. And finally, the Season 6 Featherweight Tournament Championship, Daniel Strauss versus Marlon Sandro. This fight almost ended before it began in the first round. Daniel Strauss landing this vicious groin shot, but Marlon Sandro comes back to fight. You see here trying for the inside trip. Daniel Strauss able to get a takedown. Marlon Sandro threw him back in that first round, but it was the pressure of Daniel Strauss that Marlon Sandro had so much trouble dealing with throughout this fight. Never the initiator waiting for Strauss to come in, but Strauss stayed tight in the third round. Marlon Sandro looking to finish with a standing arm triangle, but it was not to be as Daniel Strauss finished out taking the back of the Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu black belt. He wins a unanimous decision victory and the featherweight tournament. $100,000 and a world title shot to the winner, Daniel Strauss. For the latest Bellator news and information, it's bellator.com.